guys, so today I have another Swatchaholic video for you, and this is the second one, I believe. So, yeah, ten more products to swatch and review for you guys, and one, two, three, four, six, seven, eight of them are from Maybelline, and two of them are just random, but I'm going to start with the two random ones. So this first one is by Lip Smacker, and it is the Lip Shake Gloss in Raspberry and Milk Chocolate. And this is a really, like, messy loss. Um, oh, okay. So, the wand looks like this. And it's just a nice gloss. It's pretty sheer. Um, it does have a little bit of brownish color. Um, it's right here. Actually, it's right there, but... It's very sheer, but it gives your lips a nice natural look. Um, I do like this. Um, I'm not going to repurchase it again. Obviously, I don't know if you can get it anymore, but, um, yeah, just thought I would review it for you, and it's actually the M&M's lip shade gloss, but I don't know how you can see. Okay, but, um, so that is that, and let's do the other random one without knocking anything else over, Aurora. Smooth. Okay, so this next one is by Forever 21, and it is the Love and Beauty Sparkling Lip Gloss in Peony. At least I think that's how you pronounce it. If you pronounce it some way different, whatever. But again, that's the wall, actually, the door. Pat that. Pat that door, Aurora. Okay. Anyway, um, I'm getting a lot of, like, feedback on that at school, especially. Awkward. Okay. Wow, that's off topic. But it's just a um, tube like that, so I'll give you guys a swatch. I actually kind of like doing this video. Well, these videos. It's kind of fun. Okay. So it looks like this. It is a really nice sheer pink color. Um, I got this as a gift from my friend... And, um, yeah, I just like wearing it. It's kind of sticky, though. Um, but it's a really nice sheer pink sparkly color. And I know the lighting is bad right now, but whatever. And you guys probably watched my outfit of the day today, but I'm just going to stand up and show you my pants because I love them. And, yeah, I'm trying not to get this stuff on my shirt because that would be bad. I kind of put... I mean, I was eating, like, your peppermint patty and, um, some chocolate kind of got on my white blouse today. But anyway, so let's do, um, two of these are new products that I recently got. So the first one is, um, by Maybelline, Awkward Silence, and it is another color whisper, and this one is in Ula Lilac. I'm obsessed with this color, you guys. I am obsessed. And it looks like this. It's so pretty. Um, the camera is making it darker than it actually is, but that's cool because I'm just going to give you guys a nice swatch, and it looks like that. It is such a gorgeous purple. Um, I love wearing this. Um, I don't wear it too often. I haven't worn it to school yet, but um, it's just a really, really gorgeous purple, and I absolutely Love it, and it's so pretty for the springtime, and I can't wait um, to do some videos, maybe tutorials with this, but it's so pretty, and it's so nice to wear. I definitely, definitely recommend you go get this color, or any color whisper. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven products left to review, and they're all baby lips. So yeah, let us just get started with the clear ones. So the first one is the Baby Lips in Quenched, and this one is the Sunscreen SPF one. Well, it's one of them. There are two. But, so it just looks like this, nice and clear. And I'll do it under the ones that I've already swatched for you guys. So it is right here. You can't see it because it's clear. Um, but it tastes like, sort of like sunblock, but kind of like, like lemon and mint. I don't know. But um, this is a really nice one. I usually take this one to school. Or the peppermint one which is also a clear um, sunscreen one, and it's kind of screwed up because I kind of screwed it up, but um, that's okay. And it's right under that one, but you can't see that one either because it's clear, obviously. And um, yeah, but I love these two. These are really nice, and I use these two the most, I would say. 
So now we'll do the other ones that are not limited edition that I have. So the first one is this one, and it is Grapevine. And I, my friend actually got this for me for Christmas. And, um, yeah, so it looks like this. It's a really nice pur uh, uh, purple color. I believe I did a video reviewing the Maybelline Baby Lips. I think I did. But, yeah. And it looks like this. It's a really nice purple mauve color, and, um, yeah. So that's that one. I really like this one. So then this next one is called Cherry Me, and it is a really gorgeous cherry red. And I'll also watch it for you guys. So it looks like this. My hands are really dry, I'm sorry. But it looks like that. And it's just really nice, smells like cherries, and it's a gorgeous red. I definitely recommend this if you're looking for a nice red lip balm. Okay, so I have three more products to review for you guys. So the first one I haven't actually worn at all, and it is Peach Kiss. I just finished up my other one, and then I'm going to get into this one, but that's how long it is. Actually, that's how long it is. But it's a really nice peach color. Again, I love this one. It is so pretty. And it looks like this. It's a really nice peachy color. And, um, yeah, I definitely would recommend this one if you're looking for a nice peachy nude. This is my first one. Actually, it's my second one of this. But, yeah, all the same. Okay, so then my um, ninth product that I'm going to be reviewing is Pink Punch. And I love this one. It is so pretty. It's the most, it's like so pretty. It's like the most gorgeous pink you ever come across. And it looks like that. It is so freaking pretty. I love this pink. I wear this pretty much every day um, over my clear one. But yeah, I definitely would recommend that. So the last product I have is another Baby Lips. And this is one of the limited edition ones in Coral Crush. And it looks like this. It's a really bright coral. Um, the camera is making it darker than it actually is. But um, it's a really gorgeous um, coral. Kind of like Coral Ambition, but not too similar. But it looks like this. And it's so pretty. It smells absolutely amazing. Um, some people don't like this one, but I really like this one. Um, I think for the spring, this is going to be so pretty. And yeah, so I would definitely recommend going to get all these products if you can find them. And so here are all the swatches again. And um, there's my favorite right there. Okay. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed, and comment down below any video requests you might have, or, um, yeah, but make sure to like, subscribe, and comment, and I will see you guys later. Bye!